And now to politics, progressives, governors on Thursday paid a courtesy visit on the president-elect Ashwa Jubala Tinubu at his residence in Abuja. Members of the Forum for Governors elected on the platform of the APC say that that visit is to welcome Ashwa Jutinubu back to the country and also pay Salah homage to ensure that they key into the vision of the Tinubu Shetima administration. Ola Wakon was there. It has been a beehive of activities as visitors continued to pay a courtesy visit to the president-elect Ashiwaju Bola Tinubu ahead of the May 29 inauguration. Okay. Governors, lawmakers, industrialists, traditional rulers and party faithful have turned the president-elect residence to Mecca of sorts. It is the turn of APC governors to welcome the president-elect back to the country. They held a closed-door meeting with him and the vice president-elect, Senator Kashim Shetima. We came to see him for two reasons. One, to welcome him back to the country, to pay Salah homage, and also brief him on the assignment he gave us. And the meeting went very well. And the convention will continue. Um, the agenda of the Governors Forum is to ensure that uh, we key into the vision of the incoming president. The president-elect was magnanimous in expressing his thoughts in the Renewed Hope Manifesto, he told the world what we are, what he's promising. He had been on campaign trails across the country and he has expatiated on that. So, A, President Aswaju Bola Ametinibu has offered renewed hope for the nation. And I believe we will see more of it from May 29th. The governors say they are ready to work for the success of Ashiwaju Tinubu's administration from day one. Everything that he will require, that will enable him to deliver to his promises during campaign, we will always support that. By the special grace of God, we're going to come up with choices that is going to reflect the unity of our country, and Nigeria is going to be better off for it. Other visitors expressed confidence in the president-elect's capability to move the country forward. Nigeria is a fact. It has been a fact for a long time. It has its challenges, it has its difficulties, but it also has its advantages and opportunities. And we all know it. It's a question of just a determined leadership that will harness all the positives and move the country forward. Um, and I have every confidence um, President Tinubu, as he will be, uh, will do so. What we need is to pray to God Almighty to continue to guide our incoming president and all the principal players. The Emir of Kano, Aminu Adu Bayero, and businessman Arthur Eze were among those who also paid a courtesy visit to President-elect ahead of the May 29 inauguration. Ola Awakon, TVC News, Abuja.